bulletin. Numerous severe thunderstorms are expected across our area today, since a squall line will be moving into our area later today. That line of severe thunderstorms, according to the Storm Prediction Center, has a chance of producing large hail, damaging wind gusts and a few tornadoes, some severe. Please stay informed on the weather conditions, since they can become hazardous at times by using the NOAA weather radio service or any news channel. If you are under a warning, make sure you listen carefully. The National Weather Service has issued Tornado Watch number 484, effective until 10 p.m. This watch includes parts of the following areas, northern Mississippi and southwestern Tennessee. Remember, a tornado watch means conditions are favorable for tornadoes and severe thunderstorms in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons in the area should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets or internet sources for the latest severe weather information. Repeating, the National Weather Service has issued a tornado watch for parts of the following areas. Northern Mississippi and southwestern Tennessee. The National Weather Service in Jackson has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for Central Chickaw County in southeastern Arkansas, Southern Sunflower County in northwestern Mississippi, Southwestern Leffler County in north central Mississippi, Washington County in northwestern Mississippi, Northern Humphreys County in central Mississippi and South Central Bolivar County in northwestern Mississippi until 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.26 p.m. Central Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated a severe thunderstorm over Chicka Junction, or near Eudora, moving east at 45 miles per hour. Hazard. 60 miles per hour wind gusts and nickel-size hail. Source. Radar indicated. Impact. Expect damage to roofs, siding and trees. The severe thunderstorm will be near. Avon and Wayside around 3.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. A steel around 3.55 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Leland around 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Tribbett and Darlow around 4.05 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Holly Ridge around 4.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Indianola and Ivernus around 4.20 p.m. Central Daylight Time and Moorhead around 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations impacted by this storm include Arcola. Precautionary Preparedness Actions. For your protection move to an interior room inside a sturdy building. A tornado watch remains in effect for the area. Although a tornado is not immediately likely, if one is spotted, act quickly and move to a place of safety in a sturdy structure, such as a basement or a small interior room. The National Weather Service in Jackson has issued a tornado warning for Northeastern Chickaw County in southeastern Arkansas, Southern Sunflower County in northwestern Mississippi, Northern Washington County in northwestern Mississippi and South Central Bolivar County in northwestern Mississippi until 4.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time.
At 3.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a confirmed tornado was located near Lake Village, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Hazard Tornado and quarter size hail. Source Trained weather spotters. Impact Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows, and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. The tornado will be near. Greenville and Metcalf around 3.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Leland around 3.50 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Tribbett around 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Holly Ridge around 4.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Indianola around 4.25 p.m. Central Daylight Time and Moorhead around 4.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a tornado has been confirmed by storm spotters. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are in a mobile home or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. The National Weather Service in Jackson has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for northwestern Choctaw County in central Mississippi, east central Carroll in north central Mississippi, northwestern Octabetha in northeastern Mississippi, northwestern Natala County in central Mississippi, Webster County in north central Mississippi, central Montgomery County in north central Mississippi, and northwestern Clay County in northeastern Mississippi. Until 7 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 6.1 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located near Kilmichael, or 7 miles southeast of Winona, moving northeast at 45 miles per hour. Hazard 60 miles per hour gusts and half dollar size hail. Source Radar indicated Impact Expect damage to roofs, siding and trees. The severe thunderstorm will be near. Kilmichael around 6.5 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Lodi around 6.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Embry around 6.25 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Weeper and Bellefontaine around 6.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Bethesda around 6.35 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Clarkson around 6.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Cumberland around 6.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time and Montpelier around 6.55 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations impacted by this storm include Mantee and Walthall. Precautionary Preparedness Actions A tornado watch remains in effect for the area. Although a tornado is not immediately likely, if one is spotted, act quickly and move to a place of safety in a sturdy structure, such as a basement or small interior room. For your protection, move to an interior room on the lowest floor of your home or business. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. The National Weather Service in Jackson has issued a tornado warning for Northern Choctaw County in central Mississippi, Northwestern Octabetha County in northeastern Mississippi, Webster County in north central Mississippi, Southeastern Montgomery County in north central Mississippi and Clay County in northeastern Mississippi. Until 7 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 6.10 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a large and extremely dangerous tornado was located near Kilmichael, moving northeast at 55 miles per hour. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Take cover now. Hazard. Dangerous tornado. Source. 
Emergency management confirmed tornado. Impact. You are in a life-threatening situation. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Considerable damage to homes, businesses, and vehicles is likely and complete destruction is possible. The tornado will be near. We brought around 6.20 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Bethesden, Clarkson and Sherwood around 6.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Mabin and Cumberland around 6.35 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Feeble around 6.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Montpelier around 6.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Griffith around 6.50 p.m. Central Daylight Time and Palo Alto around 6.55 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations impacted by this tornadic thunderstorm include Mantee and Walthall. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a large and extremely dangerous tornado is on the ground. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If in a mobile home, in a vehicle or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Heavy rainfall may obscure this tornado. Do not wait to see or hear the tornado. Take cover now. The National Weather Service in Birmingham has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Tuscaloosa County in west-central Alabama, southeastern Pickens County in west-central Alabama, Marengo County in southwestern Alabama, Perry County in central Alabama, Greene County in west-central Alabama, Hale County in west-central Alabama, southern Bibb County in central Alabama, southwestern Dallas County in south-central Alabama and Sumter County in west-central Alabama until 8.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 7.21 p.m. Central Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Johnston Lake to 7 miles southeast of Snell, moving east at 50 miles per hour. Hazard. 60 miles per hour wind gusts and half dollar size hail. Source. Trained weather spotters. Impact. Expect damage to roofs, siding and trees. This line of storms will be near. Benevolent Johnston Lake around 7.25 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Mantua around 7.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Union and Gina around 7.35 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Knoxville around 7.40 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Putnam around 7.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Nanathalia around 7.50 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Moundville. Sweetwater and Shelton State Community College around 7.55 p.m. Central Daylight Time and Wayne around 8 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations impacted include Half Acre, U.S. Highway 80 and Alabama 28, Englewood, New Mount Hebron, Old Spring Hill, Belmont, Octagon, Maxwell and Safford. Precautionary Preparedness Actions A tornado watch remains in effect for the area. Although a tornado is not immediately likely, if one is spotted, Act quickly and move to a place of safety in a sturdy structure, such as a basement or a small for Danapolis and the surrounding areas. The National Weather Service in Birmingham has issued a tornado warning for 
northern marengo county in southwestern alabama west central perry county in central alabama southeastern greene county in west central alabama southern hale county in west central alabama and southeastern sumter county in west central alabama until eight fifteen p m. central daylight time at seven forty six p m. central daylight time a large and destructive tornado was located near demobilis moving east at fifty five miles per hour this is a tornado emergency for demobilis and the surrounding areas this is a particularly dangerous situation take cover now hazard deadly tornado source trained weather spotters impact you are in a life-threatening situation flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter mobile homes will be destroyed considerable damage to homes businesses and vehicles is likely and complete destruction is possible the tornado will be near Fonsdale around 8 5 p.m. Central Daylight Time and Uniontown and New Bern around 8 10 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations impacted by this tornadic thunderstorm include U.S. Highway 80 and Alabama 28, Old Spring Hill, Belmont, Burbank, Demopolis Lock and Dam, Galleon, Laneville, Chadarville, Folsom and McDowell. Precautionary Preparedness Actions to repeat, a large, extremely dangerous and potentially deadly tornado is on the ground. To protect your life, take cover now. Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If in a mobile home, a vehicle or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Heavy rainfall may obscure this tornado. Do not wait to see or hear the tornado, take cover now. The National Weather Service in Huntsville has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southwestern Jackson County in northeastern Alabama, Marshall County in northeastern Alabama, Madison County in north-central Alabama, southeastern Lauderdale in northwestern Alabama, Limestone County in north-central Alabama, Cullman County in north-central Alabama, Morgan County in north-central Alabama, eastern Lawrence County in northwestern Alabama and southwestern Lincoln County in middle Tennessee until 9.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 8.27 p.m. Central Daylight Time, severe thunderstorms were located along a line extending from near Rogersville to 6 miles northwest of Dodge City, moving east at 35 miles per hour. Hazard. 60 miles per hour wind gusts and ping-pong ball-sized hail. Source. Radar indicated. Impact. Expect damage to roofs, damage in trees. Locations impacted include Huntsville, Decatur, Madison, Athens, Albertville, Cullman, Hartzell, Boaz, Guntersville, Arab, Fayetteville, Moores Mill, Maradineville, Redstone Arsenal, Hazel Green, Hansville, Priceville, Good Hope, Trinity and Owens Cross Roads. Precautionary Preparedness Actions A tornado watch remains in effect for the area. Although a tornado is not immediately likely, if one is spotted, Act quickly and move to a place of safety in a sturdy structure, such as a basement or a small interior room. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Torrential rainfall is also occurring with these storms, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. The National Weather Service in Birmingham has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for southeastern Walker County in central Alabama, west central Talladega County in east central Alabama, southeastern Blount County in central Alabama, 
northern Shelby County in central Alabama, Jefferson County in central Alabama and southwestern St. Clair County in central Alabama until 9.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 8.38 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm was located over Oak Grove, moving east at 55 miles per hour. Hazard. 70 miles per hour wind gusts and ping pong ball sized hail. Source. Trained weather spotters. Impact. Expect damage to roofs, siding and trees. Locations impacted include. Birmingham, Hoover, Vestavia, Hills, Bessemer, Homewood, Pelham, Mountain Brook, Trussville, Hueytown, Gardendale, Irondale, Leeds, Moody, Fairfield, Chelsea, Fultondale, Oneonta, Springville, Odenville and Dallas. Precautionary Preparedness Actions A tornado watch remains in effect for the area. Although a tornado is not immediately likely, if one is spotted, act quickly and move to a place of safety in a sturdy structure such as a basement or small interior room. For your protection move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Torrential rainfall is occurring with this storm, and may lead to flash flooding. Do not drive your vehicle through flooded roadways. tornado emergency for the Birmingham Metro. The National Weather Service in Birmingham has issued a tornado warning for Central Jefferson County in Central Alabama until 9.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 8.44 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a large and destructive tornado was located over Edgewater, or near Fairfield, moving east at 55 miles per hour. Tornado emergency for the Birmingham Metro. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Take cover now. Hazard. Deadly tornado. Source. Emergency management confirmed tornado. Impact. You are in a life-threatening situation. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Considerable damage to homes, businesses, and vehicles is likely and complete destruction is possible. Locations impacted include. Birmingham, Vestavia Hills, Bessemer. Homewood, Mountain Brook, Hueytown, Gardendale, Irondale, Fairfield, Fultondale, Center Point, Pleasant Grove, Tarrant, Midfield, Adamsville, Brighton, Lipscomb, Graysville, Sylvan Springs and Brookside. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a large, extremely dangerous and potentially deadly tornado is on the ground. To protect your life, take cover now. Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If in a mobile home, a vehicle or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Heavy rainfall may obscure this tornado. Do not wait to see or hear the tornado. Take cover now. a tornado warning for northwestern Jackson County in northeastern Alabama, central Madison County in north central Alabama and east central Morgan County in north central Alabama until 9.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 9.7 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a large and extremely dangerous tornado was located near Madison, moving northeast at 55 miles per hour. Hazard. Damaging tornado. Source. Trained weather spotters. Impact. You are in a life-threatening situation. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Considerable damage to homes, businesses, and vehicles is likely and complete destruction is possible. The tornado will be near. 
Redstone Arsenal and University of Alabama in Huntsville around 9.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Alabama A&M University around 9.20 p.m. Central Daylight Time and Gurley and New Market around 9.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations impacted include Paint Rock, Maysville, Limrock, Princeton, Estillfort, Hampton Cove, Brownsboro, Larkin, Farley and Pleasant Groves. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a large, extremely dangerous and potentially deadly tornado is on the ground. To protect your life, take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Tornadoes are extremely hard to see and confirm at night. Do not wait to see or hear the tornado. Take cover now. The National Weather Service in Birmingham has issued a tornado warning for southwestern Talladega County in east central Alabama, southeastern Shelby County in central Alabama and southwestern Clay County in east central Alabama until 9.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 9.16 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a confirmed large tornado was located near Foster's Cross Roads, moving east at 55 miles per hour. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Take cover now. Hazard. Damaging tornado. Source. Radar confirmed tornado. Impact. You are in a life-threatening situation. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Considerable damage to homes, businesses, and vehicles is likely and complete destruction is possible. Locations impacted include Talladega, Silicaunga, Childersburg, Columbiana, Wilsonville, Vincent, Harpersville, Waldo, Fayetteville, Winterboro, Alpine, Sycamore, Lay Lake, Silicaunga Municipal Airport, Beeswax Creek Park, Alabama 4-H Center, Shelby Shores, Cedar Creek, Kelly Branch and Varnums. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a large, extremely dangerous and potentially deadly tornado is on the ground. To protect your life, take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. If you are outdoors, in a mobile home or in a vehicle, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Heavy rainfall may obscure this tornado. Do not wait to see or hear the tornado. Take cover now. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a tornado has been confirmed on the ground. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are in a mobile home, in a vehicle or outdoors, 
Move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. According to a preliminary report from the National Weather Service, the system that caused the tornado outbreak yesterday spawned 57 tornadoes, including an EF-4 that destroyed a part of the Demopolis area and an EF-3 that dealt some damage in the Birmingham area. This is only a preliminary report. It can still be subject to change. Unfortunately, an EF-2 that occurred in the Huntsville area claimed two lives when a tree fell on a home. Thankfully severe weather appears unlikely for the following days. Now for the weather forecast. For today, in Montgomery. National Hurricane Center. Subtropical Depression 14 Advisory No. 1. Subtropical Depression forms over the open Atlantic. Expected to transition to a tropical system soon. Current storm information. Location, 30.3 degrees north 70.2 degrees west, or 345 miles west-southwest of Bermuda. Sustained winds, 30 knots, or 35 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 1,004 millibars, or 29.65 inches. Movement, south-southwest at 5 miles per hour. From the National Hurricane Center. Subtropical Storm Mindy Advisory No. 3. Depression intensifies into Subtropical Storm Mindy. Watches and warnings issued for Florida and the Bahamas. Current storm information. Location, 29.4 degrees north 71.3 degrees west, or 430 miles southwest from Bermuda. Sustained winds, 35 knots, or 40 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 1,000 millibars, or 29.53 inches. Movement, southwest at 15 miles per hour. On the other side, you calling me up at the same time. I'm in the daylight. Calling to say hi, but your words they cry. If there's something that you need to.
The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm watch for the following counties in Florida, Miami-Dade, Broward, and Palm Beach. Until further notice, listen to NOAA Weather Radio for a more detailed statement on the situation. Hurricane Center. Tropical Storm Mindy Advisory No. 6. Mindy transitions to a tropical cyclone. Hurricane warning issued for Long Island, Bahamas. Current storm information. Location, 26.9 degrees north 73.9 degrees west, or 300 miles northeast from Grand Bahama. Sustained winds, 40 knots, or 45 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 998 millibars, or 29.47 inches. Movement, south at 9 miles per hour. The National Weather Service has issued a hurricane watch for the following counties. Monroe, Florida. Until further notice. A more detailed statement will follow shortly. A hurricane watches in effect for the Florida Keys. New information since the last issuance. This is the first issuance of a hurricane local statement for Tropical Storm Mindy. Areas affected. This statement concerns the Florida Keys of Monroe County. Watches and warnings. A hurricane watches in effect for all of the Florida Keys in Monroe County. A hurricane watch means that hurricane force winds are possible over the area, in this case within the next 48 hours. At 11 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, the center of Tropical Storm Mindy was located near latitude 25.4 degrees north, longitude 74 degrees west, about 260 miles east-northeast of Grand Bahama. Mindy was moving south at 8 miles per hour. A continued southward motion, then southwestward and westward is expected with little to no change in speed. Maximum sustained winds were near 65 miles per hour with higher gusts. Mindy is currently a tropical storm, but is forecasted to near the worn area as a high-end Category 1 hurricane. The estimated minimal pressure was estimated at 990 millibars, or 29.23 inches of mercury. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Engage your hurricane preparation plan now. Prepare to evacuate if the situation was to change, and stay tuned to reliable information sources to get updates on the situation. Why the impacts? Tropical storm force winds are forecasted to impact the area within the next 40 hours, and hurricane force winds are forecasted to impact the area within 48 hours. Driving in these conditions will not be recommended. Rainfall impacts. Rainfall of about 1 to 2 inches per hour is expected, and can possibly lead to flooding in flood-prone areas. Next update. The next update on Tropical Storm Mindy will be issued by 5 a.m. tomorrow since the tropical storm warning is likely to be issued at that time. From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Advisory No. 10. Mindy strengthens to a hurricane. Current storm information. Location, 23.5 degrees north 74.4 degrees west, or 230 miles east-southeast from Grand Bahama. Sustained winds, 65 knots, or 75 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 984 millibars, or 29.06 inches. 
Movement, southwest at 14 miles per hour. The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm warning for the following counties. Monroe, Florida. Until further notice. A hurricane watch is still in effect for the area. Listen to NOAA Weather Radio for more details on this situation. The National Weather Service has canceled the hurricane watch that was in effect for the following counties. Monroe, Florida. Until further notice. A tropical storm warning is still in effect for the area. A more detailed statement will follow shortly. A tropical storm warning is in effect for the Florida Keys. A hurricane watch has been canceled for the Florida Keys. New information since the last issuance. A hurricane watch has been canceled for the area. Storm information has been updated. Wind impacts have been updated. Areas affected. This statement concerns the Florida Keys of Monroe County. Watches and warnings. A tropical storm warning is in effect for all of the Florida Keys in Monroe County. A tropical storm warning means that tropical storm force winds are possible over the area, in this case within the next 36 hours. At 5 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, the center of Hurricane Mindy was located near latitude 22.7 degrees north, longitude 75.5 degrees west, about 205 miles southeast of Grand Bahama. Mindy was moving southwest at 14 miles per hour. A continued southward motion, then southwestward and westward is expected with little to no change in speed. Maximum sustained winds were near 85 miles per hour with higher gusts. Mindy is currently a Category 1 hurricane, but is forecasted to near the worn area as a high-end tropical storm. The estimated minimal pressure was estimated at 983 millibars, or 29.03 inches of mercury. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Stay tuned to reliable information sources to get updates on the situation. Wind impacts. Tropical storm force winds are forecasted to impact the area within the next 30 hours driving in these conditions will not be recommended. Rainfall impacts. Rainfall of about 2 to 3 inches per hour is expected and can possibly lead to flooding in flood prone areas. Next update. The next update on Hurricane Mindy will be issued by 5 p.m. tonight since tropical storm warnings are likely to be needed for other counties in Florida. The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm warning for the following counties in Florida. Collier, Lee and Charlotte. Until further notice. Listen to NOAA Weather Radio for more information on this situation.
From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Advisory No. 12. Mindy strengthens some more while nearing the coast of Cuba. Current storm information. Location, 22.3 degrees north 76.5 degrees west, or 180 miles south-southwest of Grand Bahama. Sustained winds, 75 knots, or 85 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 979 millibars, or 28.91 inches. Movement, west at 14 miles per hour. The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm warning for the following counties in Florida. Sarasota, Manatee, Hillsborough, Pinellas, Pasco and Hernando. Until further notice. A more detailed statement will follow shortly. A tropical storm warning is in effect for the Florida Keys. A tropical storm warning is in effect for the following counties in Florida. Collier, Lee, Charlotte, Sarasota, Manatee, Hillsboro, Pinellas, Pasco and Hernando. New information since the last issuance. A tropical storm watch has been issued for the following counties. Sarasota, Manatee, Hillsboro, Pinellas, Pasco and Hernando. Storm information has been updated. Areas affected. This statement concerns the Florida Keys of Monroe County and parts of the Florida Gulf Coast. Watches and warnings. A tropical storm warning is in effect for all of the Florida Keys in Monroe County. A tropical storm warning is in effect for parts of the Florida Gulf Coast. A tropical storm warning means that tropical storm force winds are possible over the area, in this case within the next 36 hours. At 11 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time, the center of Hurricane Mindy was located near latitude 22.3 degrees north, longitude 76.5 degrees west, about 280 miles south-southwest of Grand Bahama. Mindy was moving west at 14 miles per hour. A continued westward motion is expected with little to no change in speed. Maximum sustained winds were near 90 miles per hour with higher gusts. Mindy is currently a Category 1 hurricane, and is not forecasted to impact directly the Warren area, but will still bring tropical storm conditions later this week. The estimated minimal pressure was estimated at 979 millibars, or 28.91 inches of mercury. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Stay tuned to reliable information sources to get updates on the situation. Why the Impacts Tropical storm force winds are forecasted to impact the areas within the next 36 hours driving in these conditions will not be recommended. Rainfall impacts. Rainfall of about 2-3 inches per hour is expected and can possibly lead to flooding in flood-prone areas. Next update. The next update on Hurricane Mindy will be issued by 11 p.m. tonight, since other warnings are likely to be needed for other counties in the United States. From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Update Statement. Mindy makes landfall in Cuba. Current storm information. Location, 22.5 degrees north 78.3 degrees west, or 105 miles east of Santa Clara, Cuba. Sustained winds, 80 knots, or 90 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 974 millibars, or 28.76 inches. Movement, west at 14 miles per hour.
Tropical Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Advisory No. 14. Mindy Inland in Cuba. Tropical storm warning issued for a portion of the Florida Gulf Coast. Current storm information. Location, 22.4 degrees north 79.1 degrees west, or 55 miles east of Santa Clara, Cuba. Sustained winds, 65 knots, or 75 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 985 millibars, or 29.06 inches. Movement, west at 14 miles per hour. The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm warning for the following counties in Florida, Citrus, Levy, Dixie and Taylor, until further notice. A more detailed statement will follow shortly. A tropical storm warning is in effect for the Florida Keys. A tropical storm warning is in effect for parts of the Florida Gulf Coast. New information since the last issuance. A tropical storm watch has been issued for the following counties. Citrus, Levy, Dixie and Taylor. Storm information has been updated. Wind impacts have been updated. Areas affected. This statement concerns the Florida Keys of Monroe County and parts of the Florida Gulf Coast. Watches and warnings. A tropical storm warning is in effect for all of the Florida Keys in Monroe County. A tropical storm warning is in effect for parts of the Florida Gulf Coast. A tropical storm warning means that tropical storm force winds are possible over the area, in this case within the next 36 hours. At 11 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, the center of Hurricane Mindy was located near latitude 22.4 degrees north, longitude 79.1 degrees west about 55 miles east of Santa Clara, Cuba. Mindy was moving west at 14 miles per hour. A continued westward motion, with a turn to the northwest in about 12 hours is expected with little to no change in speed. Maximum sustained winds were near 75 miles per hour with higher gusts. Mindy is currently a Category 1 hurricane, and is forecasted to weaken to high end tropical storm status before re-emerging over the Atlantic. The estimated minimal pressure was estimated at 985 millibars, or 29.06 inches of mercury. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Stay tuned to reliable information sources to get updates on the situation. Wind Impacts Tropical storm force winds are forecasted to impact the areas within the next 36 hours driving in these conditions will not be recommended. Rainfall Impacts Rainfall of about 2-3 inches per hour is expected, and can possibly lead to flooding in flood-prone areas. Next update. The next update on Hurricane Mindy will be issued by 5 a.m. tomorrow morning, since other warnings are likely to be needed for other counties in the United States. The National Weather Service has issued a hurricane watch for the following counties. In Florida, Franklin, Gulf, Bay, Walton, Wakalusa, Santa Rosa and Escambia, the following counties in Alabama. Baldwin and Mobile and the following counties in Mississippi. Jackson. Until further notice. Please listen to NOAA Weather Radio for more information on this situation. Structure fire was then controlled totally by the firefighters after four hours. No one was in.
The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm warning for the following counties. In Florida, Franklin, Gulf, Bay, Walton, Wakalusa, Santa Rosa and Escambia, the following counties in Alabama. Baldwin and Mobile and the following counties in Mississippi. Jackson. Until further notice. A hurricane watch is still in effect in the areas. Please listen to NOAA Weather Radio for more information on this situation. From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Advisory No. 18. Mindy strengthens back to hurricane status. Current storm information. Location, 25.7 degrees north 82.9 degrees west, or 80 miles west-southwest of Naples, Florida. Sustained winds, 65 knots, or 75 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 982 millibars, or 29 inches. Movement, north-northwest at 18 miles per hour. From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Advisory No. 20. Mindy strengthens to a Category 2 hurricane. Current storm information. Location, 28.1 degrees north 84.7 degrees west, or 115 miles west of Clearwater, Florida. Sustained winds, 85 knots, or 100 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 971 millibars, or 28.67 inches. Movement, northwest at 18 miles per hour. From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Advisory No. 22. Mindy becomes the third major hurricane of the season. Current storm information. Location, 29.2 degrees north 85.7 degrees west, or 60 miles southwest of Apalachicola, Florida. Sustained winds, 100 knots, or 115 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 957 millibars, or 28.26 inches. Movement, northwest at 7 miles per hour. The National Weather Service has issued Tornado Watch No. 486, effective until 5 p.m. This watch includes parts of the Florida Panhandle. Remember, a tornado watch means conditions are favorable for tornadoes and severe thunderstorms in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons in the area should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio commercial radio and television outlets or internet sources for the latest severe weather information. Repeating, the National Weather Service has issued a tornado watch for parts of the Florida Panhandle.
The National Weather Service in Tallahassee has issued a tornado warning for Northern Wakulla County in Big Bend, Florida, Southeastern Liberty County in Big Bend, Florida, and Southwestern Leon County in Big Bend, Florida, until 1.30 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 12.55 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, a confirmed tornado was located near Woodville, moving west at 55 miles per hour. Hazard. Confirmed tornado. Source. Law enforcement confirmed tornado. Impact. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. This dangerous storm will be near. Crawfordville around 2 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. Other locations impacted include Newport, Talaja, East Camp, Jewel Fire Tower, Shadyville, Brown House, Leon Sinks, Hyde Park, Wakulla Springs and Aaron. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a tornado has been confirmed by storm spotters. Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are in a mobile home or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. The National Weather Service has upgraded a hurricane watch to a hurricane warning for the following counties. In Florida, Wakalusa, Santa Rosa and Escambia, and the following counties in Alabama. Baldwin. Until further notice. The tropical storm warning in effect for the area has been canceled. A more detailed statement will follow shortly. The National Weather Service has issued a storm surge warning for the following counties. In Florida, Franklin, Gulf, Bay, Walton, Wakalusa, Santa Rosa and Escambia, the following counties in Alabama. Baldwin and Mobile and the following counties in Mississippi. Jackson. Until further notice. A more detailed statement will follow shortly. A storm surge warning is in effect for the Alabama Gulf Coast and parts of the Florida Panhandle. New information since the last issuance. A storm surge warning has been issued for Franklin, Gulf, Bay, Walton, Wakalusa, Santa Rosa and Escambia in Florida, Baldwin and Mobile in Alabama and Jackson in Mississippi. A hurricane watch has been upgraded to a hurricane warning for Wakalusa, Santa Rosa and Escambia in Florida and Baldwin in Alabama. Storm information has been updated. Wind impacts have been updated. Rainfall impacts have been updated. Tornado impacts have been updated. Areas affected. This statement concerns parts of the northern Gulf Coast. Watches and warnings. A storm surge warning is in effect for the following counties. Franklin, Gulf, Bay, Walton, Wakalusa, Santa Rosa, Escambia, Baldwin, Mobile and Jackson. A hurricane warning is in effect for the following counties. Wakalusa, Santa Rosa, Escambia and Baldwin. A tropical storm warning is in effect for parts of the Florida, Mississippi and Louisiana Gulf Coast. A storm surge warning means there is a danger of life-threatening inundation, 
from rising water moving inland from the coastline during the next 36 hours in the indicated locations. For a depiction of areas at risk, please see the National Weather Service Storm Surge Watch Warning Graphic, available at hurricanes.gov. This is a life-threatening situation. Persons located within these areas should take all necessary actions to protect life and property from rising water and the potential for other dangerous conditions. Promptly follow evacuation and other instructions from local officials. A hurricane warning means that hurricane conditions are expected somewhere within the warning area. A warning is typically issued 36 hours before the anticipated first occurrence of tropical storm force winds, conditions that make outside preparations difficult or dangerous. Preparation to protect life and property should be rushed to completion. A tropical storm warning means that tropical storm force winds are possible over the area, in this case within the next 36 hours. At 10 a.m. Central Daylight Time, the center of Hurricane Mindy was located near latitude 29.7 degrees north, longitude 86.2 degrees west, about 40 miles southwest of Panama Beach. Mindy was moving northwest at 4 miles per hour. A continued northwestward motion is expected with some slowdown in the forward speed. Maximum sustained winds were near 115 miles per hour with higher gusts. Mindy is currently a Category 3 hurricane and is forecasted to keep this intensity until it makes landfall. The estimated minimal pressure was estimated at 956 millibars, or 28.23 inches of mercury. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Stay tuned to reliable information sources to get updates on the situation. Wind Impacts Hurricane force winds are going to occur in about 40 hours. Please prepare now. Tropical storm force winds are forecasted to impact the areas within the next 36 hours. Driving in these conditions will not be recommended. Rainfall Impacts Rainfall of about 3 inches per hour is expected and is likely to lead to flooding in flood-prone areas. Tornado Impacts a tornado watch is in effect. Tornadoes are possible in Mindy's outer rain bands. A tornado was reported in Woodville about an hour ago. Next update. The next update on Hurricane Mindy will be issued by 3 p.m. Central Daylight Time. The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm warning for portions of southwestern Alabama and southeastern Mississippi. Until further notice, a more detailed statement will follow shortly. A storm surge warning is in effect for the Alabama Gulf Coast and parts of the Florida Panhandle. New information since the last issuance. A tropical storm warning has been issued for parts of southwestern Alabama and southeastern Mississippi. Tornado impacts have been updated. Areas affected. This statement concerns parts of the northern Gulf Coast. Watches and warnings. A storm surge warning is in effect for the following counties. Franklin, Gulf. Bay, Walton, Wakalusa, Santa Rosa, Escambia, Baldwin, Mobile and Jackson. A hurricane warning is in effect for the following counties. Wakalusa, Santa Rosa, Escambia and Baldwin. A tropical storm warning is in effect for parts of the Florida, Mississippi and Louisiana Gulf Coast and parts of southwestern Alabama and southeastern Mississippi. A storm surge warning means there is a danger of life-threatening inundation from rising water moving inland from the coastline during the next 36 hours in the indicated locations. For a depiction of areas at risk, please see the National Weather Service Storm Surge Watch Warning Graphic, available at hurricanes.gov. This is a life-threatening situation. 
persons located within these areas should take all necessary actions to protect life and property from rising water and the potential for other dangerous conditions. Promptly follow evacuation and other instructions from local officials. A hurricane warning means that hurricane conditions are expected somewhere within the warning area. A warning is typically issued 36 hours before the anticipated first occurrence of tropical storm force winds, conditions that make outside preparations difficult or dangerous. Preparations to protect life and property should be rushed to completion. A tropical storm warning means that tropical storm force winds are possible over the area, in this case within the next 36 hours. At 10 a.m. Central Daylight Time, the center of Hurricane Mindy was located near latitude 29.7 degrees north, longitude 86.2 degrees west, about 40 miles southwest of Panama Beach. Mindy was moving northwest at 4 miles per hour. A continued northwestward motion is expected with some slowdown in the forward speed. Maximum sustained winds were near 115 miles per hour with higher gusts. Mindy is currently a Category 3 hurricane and is forecasted to keep this intensity until it makes landfall. The estimated minimal pressure was estimated at 956 millibars or 28.23 inches of mercury. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Stay tuned to reliable information sources to get updates on the situation. Wind Impacts Hurricane force winds are going to occur in about 40 hours. Please prepare now. Tropical storm force winds are forecasted to impact the areas within the next 36 hours. Driving in these conditions will not be recommended. Rainfall impacts. Rainfall of about 3 inches per hour is expected and is likely to lead to flooding in flood-prone areas. Tornado impacts. A tornado watch is in effect. Tornadoes are possible in Mindy's outer rain bands. Next update. The next update on Hurricane Mindy will be issued by 5 p.m. Central Daylight Time. From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Advisory No. 26. Mindy strengthens some more while slowing down near the Florida Panhandle. Current storm information. Location, 30.0 degrees north 86.6 degrees west, or 50 miles southeast of Pensacola, Florida. Sustained winds, 110 knots, or 125 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 952 millibars, or 28.11 inches. Movement, northwest at 2 miles per hour. The National Weather Service has issued Tornado Watch No. 487, effective until 8 p.m. This watch includes parts of the following areas, Southern Alabama and the Florida Panhandle. Remember, a tornado watch means conditions are favorable for tornadoes and severe thunderstorms in and close to the watch area. While severe weather may not be imminent, persons in the area should remain alert for rapidly changing weather conditions and listen for later statements and possible warnings. Stay tuned to NOAA Weather Radio, commercial radio and television outlets or internet sources for the latest severe weather information. Repeating, the National Weather Service has issued a tornado watch for parts of the following areas. Southern Alabama and the Florida Panhandle.
flash flood watch in effect until October 25, 2021, 5 p.m. Central Daylight Time. The National Weather Service in Mobile has issued a flash flood watch for portions of the western Florida Panhandle, southwestern Alabama and southeastern Mississippi. Through tomorrow night, Hurricane Mindy's external rain bands are forecasted to move in the Warren area during about the next 12 hours. Rainfall amounts from 2 inches to 4 inches and isolated amounts of 5 inches are expected across the Warren area. Flooding of streets, low-lying areas and small creeks is possible. Precautionary Preparedness Actions A flash flood watch means that conditions may develop that lead to flash flooding. Flash flooding is a very dangerous situation. You should monitor later forecasts and be prepared to take action when flash flood warnings are issued. The National Weather Service in Mobile has issued a tornado warning for South Central Butler County in South Central Alabama, East Central Conju County in South Central Alabama, and Northern Covington County in South Central Alabama. Until 5.45 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 5.17 a.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located near up, moving northwest at 60 miles per hour. Hazard. Tornado. Source. Radar indicated rotation. Impact. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. Locations impacted include. Andalusia, Op, Georgiana, Mackenzie, River Falls, Red Level, Heath, Gant, Logo, Cohasset, Treve, Shell, Sanford, Stanley, Duns, Annika, East Champion, Cold Water, Wiggins and Valley of Shiloh. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are in a mobile home or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. Take cover now from life-threatening winds of Hurricane Mindy. The National Weather Service in Mobile has issued an extreme wind warning for southeastern Baldwin County in southwestern Alabama. Santa Rosa County in northwestern Florida and Escambia County in northwestern Florida. Until noon CDT. At 10 9 a.m. CDT, the strongest winds from Hurricane Mindy are imminent. This is an extremely dangerous and life-threatening situation. Hazard extreme hurricane winds over 115 mph. Source. Satellite observations. Impact. Take cover now. Move immediately to the safe room in your shelter to protect yourself from flying debris. Well-built structures can sustain severe damage with loss of most of the roof and or some exterior walls. Locations impacted include Pensacola, Ferry Pass, Brent, West Pensacola, Ensley, Warrington, Gonzales, Bay Manette, Pace, Milton, Gulf Breeze, Orange Beach, Century, Baghdad, Lillian, Myrtle Grove, Oriole Beach, Navarre, Molino and Perdido Beach. Precautionary Preparedness Actions The safest place to be during a major landfalling hurricane is in a reinforced interior room away from windows. Get under a table or other piece of sturdy furniture. Use mattresses, blankets or pillows to cover your head and body. 
remain in place through the passage of these life-threatening conditions. Tornado Emergency for Crestview The National Weather Service in Mobile has issued a tornado warning for Southeastern Escambia County in South Central Alabama Southwestern Covington County in South Central Alabama Northern Okaloosa County in Northwestern Florida and Northeastern Santa Rosa County in Northwestern Florida Until noon Central Daylight Time At 11.24 a.m. Central Daylight Time a confirmed large and destructive tornado was located over Crestview, moving northwest at 45 miles per hour. Tornado Emergency for Crestview This is a particularly dangerous situation, take cover now. Hazard Deadly Tornado Source Emergency Management Confirmed Tornado Impact You are in a life-threatening situation. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Considerable damage to homes, businesses, and vehicles is likely and complete destruction is possible. Locations impacted include Crestview, Baker, Petten, Blackman, Rock Creek, Bradley, Good Hope, Silver Springs, Escambia Darms, Sellersville, Parker Springs, Bellinville, Auburn, McClellan, Garden City, Campton, Carolyn, Killingsworth Crossroads, Milligan and Clear Springs. Precautionary Preparedness Actions to repeat, a large, extremely dangerous and potentially deadly tornado is on the ground. To protect your life, take cover now. Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If in a mobile home, a vehicle or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. From the National Hurricane Center. Hurricane Mindy Update. Mindy makes landfall in Pensacola Beach. Current storm information. Location, 30.3 degrees north 87.1 degrees west, or 10 miles southeast of Pensacola, Florida. Sustained winds, 100 knots, or 115 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 954 millibars, or 28.17 inches. Movement, northwest at 3 miles per hour. The National Weather Service in Tallahassee has issued a tornado warning for southwestern Geneva County in southeastern Alabama and north-central Walton County in the Panhandle of Florida until 3.15 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 2.43 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a confirmed large and dangerous tornado was located near Dufunic Springs, moving north at 50 miles per hour. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Take cover now. Hazard Damaging Tornado Source Radar Confirmed Tornado Impact You are in a life-threatening situation. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Considerable damage to homes, businesses, and vehicles is likely and complete destruction is possible. Locations impacted include Dufunic Springs, Liberty, Paxton, Gordon, Hokoda, Cluster Springs, Gaskin, Sand Hill. Alpine Heights, Dufunic Spring Airport, Glendale, Lakewood, Pleasant Hill, Center Ridge, New Harmony, Piney Grove and Caney Creek. Precautionary Preparedness Actions To repeat, a large and dangerous tornado is on the ground. To protect your life, take cover now. 
move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If in a mobile home, a vehicle or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. The National Weather Service in Mobile has issued a flash flood warning for South Central Monroe County in South Central Alabama, Escambia County in South Central Alabama, and Southern Conecuh County in South Central Alabama until 7 p.m. Central Daylight Time. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Seek higher ground now. At 3.58 p.m. Central Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard. Flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source. Doppler radar. Impact. Flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flooding include Edmore, Bruton, Evergreen, Frisco City, East Bruton, Uriah, Castleberry, Excel, Repton, Pollard, Riverview, I-65 and AL-113, I-65 and US-84, I-65 and AL-21, Alyssa, Halls Crossroads, Parker Springs, Old Town, Brownville and Wybeek. Precautionary Preparedness Actions This is a particularly dangerous situation, seek higher ground now. Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roadways. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. The National Water Service in Mobile, Alabama has issued a tornado warning for Central Escambia County in South Central Alabama, South Central Conecuh County in South Central Alabama, Southwestern Covington County in South Central Alabama, Northwestern Alcaloosa County in Northwestern Florida, and Northeastern Santa Rosa County in Northwestern Florida until 6.15 p.m. Central Time. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Take cover now. At 5.38 p.m. Central Time, emergency management reported a large and dangerous tornado located 12 miles north of Baker, moving northwest at 50 miles per hour. This tornado is associated with landfalling Hurricane Mindy. This storm will be near Bruton, East Bruton, and Riverview at around 6.05 and Pollard at around 6.10 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Other locations impacted include Rock Creek, Bradley, Sellersville, Parker Springs, Dillonville, Kirkland, McClellan, Roberts, Rock Hill, and Dixonville. Take cover now. Move to an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Stay away from windows. If you are in a mobile home, in a vehicle or outside, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. The National Weather Service has issued a tropical storm warning for a portion of central Alabama. Until further notice, a more detailed statement will follow shortly. A tropical storm warning is in effect for portions of Alabama and Mississippi. 
new information since the last issuance. A tropical storm warning has been issued for a portion of central Alabama. Areas affected. This statement concerns portions of Alabama and Mississippi. Watches and warnings. A tropical storm warning is in effect for parts of Alabama and Mississippi. A tropical storm warning means that tropical storm force winds are possible over the area, in this case within the next 36 hours. At 4 p.m. Central Daylight Time, the center of Hurricane Mindy was located near latitude 30.4 degrees north, longitude 87.2 degrees west, about 5 miles south-southeast of Pensacola. Mindy was moving northwest at 3 miles per hour. A turn towards the north and then northwest soon. Maximum sustained winds were near 115 miles per hour with higher gusts. Mindy is currently a Category 3 major hurricane. The estimated minimal pressure was estimated at 958 millibars, or 28.29 inches of mercury. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Stay tuned to reliable information sources to get updates on the situation. Wind Impacts Tropical storm force winds are forecasted to impact the area within the next 36 hours. Driving in these conditions will not be recommended. Rainfall impacts. Rainfall of about 2-4 inches per hour is expected and can possibly lead to flooding in flood-prone areas. Next update. The next update on Hurricane Mindy will be issued by 11 p.m. tonight. The National Weather Service in Birmingham has issued a flash flood warning for Autauga County in central Alabama, Central Perry County in central Alabama, Lowndes County in south central Alabama, and Dallas County in south central Alabama until 2 a.m. Central Daylight Time. At 10.52 p.m. Central Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the worn area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard. Flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source. Doppler radar. Impact. Flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flooding include Selma, Valley Grand, Marion, Mosses, Hainville, Selmont West Selmont, Otagaville, Whitehall, Gordonville, Ormville, Lonesboro, Benton, Bogue Shido, Vaden, Tyler, Autauga County Airport, Danley Reservoir, Mulberry, Paul M. Grist State Park and Dallas Lake. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roadways. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. The National Weather Service in Birmingham has issued a tornado warning for southwestern Talladega County in East Central Alabama, northwestern Tallapoosa County in East Central Alabama, northeastern Coosa County in East Central Alabama, and southwestern Clay County in East Central Alabama, until 3.45 p.m. Central Daylight Time. At 3.16 p.m. Central Daylight Time, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located near Goodwater, moving northwest at 45 miles per hour. Hazard. Tornado. Source. Radar indicated rotation. Impact. Flying debris may be deadly to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be destroyed. Damage to roofs, windows and vehicles will occur. Tree damage is likely. Locations impacted include Alexander City, Silicauga, Childersburg, Goodwater, Kelladon, Stewartville, Bradford, Winterboro, Alpine, Sycamore, Parkdale, Hatchet, 
Cleveland Crossroads, Silicaga Municipal Airport, Overbrook, Gantz Quarry, Hollins, Hackneyville, Roselle and Mignon. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Take cover now. Move to a basement or an interior room on the lowest floor of a sturdy building. Avoid windows. If you are in a mobile home or outdoors, move to the closest substantial shelter and protect yourself from flying debris. The National Weather Service in Peachtree City has issued a flash flood warning for Merriweather County in West Central Georgia, Heard County in West Central Georgia, Troop County in West Central Georgia, and Central Coeta County in West Central Georgia until 4 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. At 10.2 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the warned area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard Flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Source. Doppler radar. Impact. Flooding of small creeks and streams, urban areas, highways, streets and underpasses as well as other drainage and low-lying areas. Some locations that will experience flooding include Noonan, Lagrange, Franklin, Greenville, Hogansville, Grantville, Woodbury, Lovesville, Ephesus, Warm Springs, Central Hatchie, Moreland, Sharpsburg, Turin, Lone Oak, East Noonan, Corinth, Mountville, Kenonville and Louise. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Turn around, don't drown when encountering flooded roadways. Most flood deaths occur in vehicles. Flash flood emergency for the Fayette and Coeta counties. The National Weather Service in Peachtree City has issued a flash flood warning for Fayette County in north central Georgia and Coeta County in west central Georgia until 3 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. This is a particularly dangerous situation. Seek higher ground now. At 10.21 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, Doppler radar indicated thunderstorms producing heavy rain across the worn area. Flash flooding is ongoing or expected to begin shortly. Hazard. Flash flooding caused by thunderstorms. Life-threatening flash flooding is already occurring. Source. Doppler radar. Some locations that will experience flooding include Noonan, Fayetteville, Peachtree City, Tyrone, Senoya, Grantville, Brooks, Moreland, Sharpsburg, Turin, East Noonan, Stars Mill, Arnco Sargent, Connellan Gate, Thomas Cross Roads and Madras. Precautionary Preparedness Actions Move to higher ground now. This is an extremely dangerous and life-threatening situation. Do not attempt to travel unless you are fleeing an area subject to flooding or under an evacuation order. A flash flood warning means that flooding is imminent or occurring. If you are in the worn area, move to higher ground immediately. Residents living along streams and creeks should take immediate precautions to protect life and property. From the National Hurricane Center. Tropical Depression Mindy Advisory No. 36. Mindy weakens to a tropical depression. Current storm information.
Location, 33.4 degrees north 85.0 degrees west, or 45 miles southwest of Atlanta, Georgia. Sustained winds, 30 knots, or 35 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 1,008 millibars, or 29.77 inches. Movement, east-northeast at 14 miles per hour. From the National Hurricane Center. Post-Tropical Depression Mindy Advisory No. 38. Mindy transitions to a post-tropical cyclone. This is the final NHC advisory. Current storm information. Location, 34.1 degrees north 81.9 degrees west, or 40 miles north of Augusta. Sustained winds, 20 knots, or 25 miles per hour. Minimal pressure, 1,012 millibars, or 29.88 inches. Movement, east-northeast at 15 miles per hour.